And happening today, a developer will ask Overland Park to allow a rooftop light display on several buildings. Yeah, the developer calls these lights artwork, but 41 Action News reporter Charlie Keegan has a live look this morning. What that display could look like and why they're having to talk to the city council about it, Charlie. Good morning, Taylor and Lindsay. The lights would go on top of the office building here behind me at City Place and on top of other buildings under construction here near College and Schweitzer as part of this development. And the city, though, in Overland Park doesn't have any rules on the books right now regulating this type of lighted artwork display. So they need to get some uh, something on the books and to regulate all of this. I want to show you now some renderings, some pictures of what this artwork would look like on the roofs of these buildings. As you can see, there are several buildings there, all with sort of different uh, artwork on the on the roofs. We got these renderings from Block Real Estate, the developer here, as part of this progress process. Now, when we Block says in its application to the city that this is considered artwork, and they wouldn't put any kind of advertisement up there or anything like that. Part of the concern, though, from the city is whether this would be a distraction. We are so close to one, uh, Highway 69 here, so they're worried that drivers might uh, get distracted as they drive past that artwork lit up in the, in the evening and nighttime hours. All this is up for discussion later this afternoon when the Overland Park Planning Committee meets at 1.30 at City Hall. That is open to the public. Anyone can go and be a part of the conversation. Reporting live, I'm Charlie Keegan, 41 Action News Today. All right, Charlie, thank you. The planning committee will also review plans for Pickleball, Pickle Bar. It's a pickleball focused entertainment venue with a bar and kitchen included. That's set to open late next year near 135th and Schweitzer Road in Overland Park.